Bishop Noel Jones presents this provocative, challenging, and life-changing message to encourage, inspire, and motivate you to keep marching toward your destiny. Now, receive this fresh oil from Bishop Noel Jones as it flows from the vials of heaven to saturate your soul. I'm going to begin in Proverbs 11, and then I'd like to read a little bit in Proverbs chapter 16, and, and then Philippians chapter 2. Auntie, I'm very and sorry for coming, but... 11 and 2. that man to you? Well, Auntie, I was waiting for the right time before I formally introduced him to you. But I think I can say it now. He's a special friend of mine. A special friend? What makes him special? Well, He's a man I hope to marry. Your fiance? But you never told me this when I called you last. I... I was still praying about him then. And are you sure you've prayed through? Kike. Because you know what marriage means. Is he a man of vision? Does he know where he's going? Is it the perfect will of God for your life? Well, he's still young in the faith. But I believe with time, he will be strong in the Lord. My girl, you are a woman. And you still have the authority now that you are still single. And not, you are not yet married to him. But the moment you come from the altar, you have released your crown and submitted your authority to him. And he will automatically become your head and begins to rule over you. So you can still pray more. It's not yet too late. Thank you, ma'am. Kike. Yes, auntie. Don't release your crown to a foolish man. Whoever fails to know the Lord is nothing but a foolish man. Guard your crown jealously. Be patient before releasing your authority. Let God guide you and be sure it is God and not your brain. Hello, Sister Kike. I've been trying your number. Hope there is no problem. No problem. I'm fine. Where are you now? Have you been posted for the NYSC? Th that is why I called. Oh, thank you. And when are you going for service? In two weeks' time. Sister Kike, I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for your answer. Why are you keeping quiet? Why can't you give me the answer? You know how many months we've been on this? Brother Samuel, now that I'm at home, I'll be able to pray very well. Please give me some more time. I'll call you for the answer very soon. Okay. I will try and wait. 
but please, please, Sister Kike, take time and pray seriously about this matter. Our God always answers His children. He will surely answer you if you sincerely call on Him. Okay. Thank you. Good night. Who was that? He's a brother in the fellowship. And who is he to you? And what are you praying for? He was the other brother. He also proposed to me. And I told him to wait till I pray through. <laughs> are you sure you are praying about his case at all? Well, not really. Why? Because of colours, is it? But why did you tell him you've already made your choice? No. I can't just do that. I'm still watching Kola. I need to be sure he stands right. He just gave his life to Christ. And I want to be very sure he's rooted and serious in Christ before I give Samuel my answer. <laughs> <laughs> ah, my girl, you are playing a game. A costly game. Uh uh. What do you mean by that, Auntie? Don't you know it's a costly game you are playing with your maker? My dear God cannot be mocked for whatever a man sows that he will reap. But I need to apply wisdom and see. Not when you are deceiving God and you are willfully disobeying his word. And don't you know if Samuel is faithfully serving God, do you think his heavenly father will leave him alone in darkness? Hear what the Bible says in Psalm chapter 18, verse 25 to 27. Here's your Bible. With the merciful, the Lord will show himself merciful. With an upright man, thou will show thyself upright. With the pure, thou will show thyself pure, and with the fraud, thou will show thyself fraud. For thou will save the humble people, but will bring down high low. Daughter, I can see you've already made your choice. But why can't you humble yourself before the Lord? Let God lead you at this time. Humble your heart and it will guide you. I don't know. 
I don't know what to tell him. Please, God. <laughs> I need you to help me. Please, God, help. Give me five. 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 Give me five.